the Paris Theatre for the premiere of The Loudest Voice. It's exciting to share it tonight with audiences. It's provocative, it's relevant. It doesn't relent, it's a really engaging and compelling watch. It's a fascinating moment to look at Fox News and how that began, and it's political and interesting and important. And to feel like a family, we've really bonded, so to be able to bring it to people, it's really exciting. I can't tell you how proud I am of this project. It was all about making it a wonderful venue for Russell to become Roger Ailes and tell that story. He's just a formidable actor and an amazing presence and completely transformed. It wasn't an easy process by any means. The prosthetic makeup, I used to actually call it being in face jail. A really big challenge for me personally. It's actually really good to be on this side of it. I always believe that if you're working with somebody who's way more talented than you, it only makes you better. It's just great when you have an exciting scene partner like him. I just met Naomi Watts, who plays me in the Showtime miniseries. This is my job, Roger. I'm a journalist. To have this kind of a caliber of actress playing this role and my story is unbelievable to me. Gretchen Carlson being the pioneer. It's a very impressive story for female empowerment, one that should be told. It's wonderful to be part of something so timely. I think it's going to be great. You know, I think people are going to really respond to it.